Wait, wait, what? You see this ratchet behavior? This ratchet behavior. Who rats are getting passports now? Ratchet hoes are getting passports now. And they're going to other countries and making a fool of themselves. You're twerking on sacred ground in, in another country, in other people's cult culture. What's wrong with us? This is this is who represents black Americans out there. These are them. Look at them. Look at this. You're twerking. Shaking your ass on holy ground. And this particular place in Ghana was where they, they, they catch the slaves and uh, enslave them, imprison them in chains and all that. Before they transport them down to, to Portugal or wherever it is in the Arab world and sell them off. So lots of sorrows and blood and tears. happened in that location to so sacred because it, it, people respect that area and these people are, are twerking shaking their ass is it twerking for the ancestors no you put, this is a curse you, you you're gonna go to these countries and bring back curses on yourself because you you don't understand the spirituality of the of the land. You have no respect for people's culture. You just go there with the American mindsets that oh we're Americans, we can do whatever we want. And if all you have, your representation of yourself, your whole being, is about your ass, you have nothing. There's more to life than shaking ass. Like people think I, I'm so harsh on black American women. That's because I love black women and I think we can do better and I believe in tough love because no cap man listen no cap right here the most brilliant intelligent group of people I have ever met in my life ever have been black women in 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 school in high school in college science technology physics math these women are incredible. I went to school with it, with these women. I know I know what the black women are capable of. But now it seems like all they want to do is shake ass on the internet. Most of those girls I grew up with and knew in school that were like excellent, topping the whole class. Years later, I see them on the internet and they've got raptor claws on. They've got the stupid eyelashes on, ex excessive makeup, BBLs. They're on the internet shaking ass. Like, what happened to you? What is this? On holy ground? You're doing this on holy ground. So you're going to Africa and you're doing this. You want to go to the motherland and you can't even respect the motherland. This is disgraceful. This is a... Vi what? <laughs> you have to be careful when you, you have to respect people's cultures. You can't go there and start misbehaving. There was a black American girl, uh, a girl living in Ghana and wanted to go and get a chieftaincy title. She wanted to become a chief. And, want, and talking about paying people some money so they can uh, coronate her chief. Coronate her? A, a woman a chief? Look, what are you talking about? They sat her down and be like, no, 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 no. We don't do that over here. Uh, we, we don't do that here. <laughs> like no we don't do that over here a woman cannot be chief over here there is there there is everyone's duties and everyone's hierarchy <laughs> we get, get a chief tansy title in africa africa is not a leftist utopia i don't know what they teach you guys in school in your uni think you're gonna go to Africa with all these your leftist ideology and your twerking and your live and let live kind of attitude no 
Why would you do this on ancestral grounds? Why? We can do better than this now. What? What didn't happen?